All right, guys, Spider, we're back here. This is sequence three, I guess. What was that Assassin's explosion? Creed. What explosion? EV. Piece of Eden detonated and took the lab with it. The magic lump of hyperbolic metal. I'm shocked. Simply because you have never valued the pieces does not All mean... went according to plan, hmm? <clears throat> Uh-oh. There was a slight complication. How slight? The lab exploded. Jacob. You derailed a train. Oh, he did. Did he? Ha! <laughs> well, the train derailed and I happened to be on it. I killed my target. Brewster is also no more. Then all in all, a successful mission in spite of you two. What about London? What about it? We're wasting our time out here. You know as well as I do that London has been the domain of the Templars for the last hundred years. They are far too strong yet. Patience. But the Templars have found a new piece of Eden. Sir David is dead. They do not know how to use it. The Council shall guide us. Sound advice that your father would have seconded. I shall see you back in Crawley. Patience, hmm. Evie. Oh, the gentle sound of opportunity passing us by. So what's stopping us? London is waiting to be liberated. Forget Crawley. Father would have wanted us to listen. Oh, father. You could continue his legacy in London. Freeing future generations from a city ruled by Templars. You know, Jacob Fry, you might just be right. Then shall we? Oh, we yeah. shall. Let's. Yes, we'll let's. Let's go. What, they're just gonna go like that? Don't they have stuff? Where's their food and shit? Let's just hop onto the next train. I guess it's not that far. Or was it? Oh, look at that! Ubisoft presents. So that was kind of like the intro to the freaking game. All right. Assassin's Creed Syndicate. There's London. London's calling. Or London's falling. Or London Bridge is falling. I don't know. I know. I know. You've only had a taste of our latest acquisition from Abstergo. But I want to check in on Sean and Rebecca. I still think attacking a Templar is a mistake. What the hell are these guys doing? Call Dr. Grammatica. <sighs> Come on. Free us a bell. What a lovely surprise. Our mutual friends will be here shortly to search for the artifact. Once it's located, I'll let you know. Super. Always a pleasure. Prick. Yeah. It's people like you that give historians a bad name. I'm afraid I don't have time for you today, Mr. Hastings. Thank you for making my job easy. What the freak? Oh, shit. It does look grim. Masterberg, Agent Acosta. Deal with them, please. Explosives Go. armed? Oh, God. Oh, snap. Hunt them down. <coughs> wow. Okay. That was a little crazy. Hey, simple plan trophy. All they had to do was wait for you to search the data. Their little stunt has put the whole operation at risk. You need to synchronize Jacob and Evie's memories. Find something that puts us ahead of the enemy. Time is of the essence, and lives are now clearly on the line. Good luck. A family of th What the fuck was that? A family of three living in a what? Was that like a riddle or something? A swell mobsman was a well-dressed pickpocket who worked in places of public entertainment. A ramsman was a burglar. A drummer drugged his victim. A sh man made counterfeit coin. Okay, what the freak am I doing? Let's just walk around. Model housing built by companies for the workers was not always model. The Great Eastern Railway was found guilty of letting flats to 100 residents with no access to water at all. All right. Let's walk this way. Or run this way. Use Eagle Vision to identify special enemies. An icon over their head will reveal if they are a sniper, lookout, or leader. Okay, that's it.
They're assassins. I think they could find food. Yeah, but they don't have anything. Like, they didn't bring anything with it. Okay, let's just go to London. We'll hop on the next train. What the hell? They don't have any... I guess... I don't know. They're assassins. So they don't have shit. At once. <laughs> Churning seas of London. It's just the way Father described. Now, to find Henry Green and formulate a plan of attack against the Templars. Is Mr. Green again? The assassin watching over London? Did you not listen the first three times? <laughs> listen to what? <laughs> Oi, watch it. Oh, you pickpocket. You pick... You, he picked Oi, my pocket. Come back here, you filthy dipper! Stop. No! Where is he? Oh, there he is, there he is, there he is. Okay. The freaking pickpocket! I saw that coming a mile away, what the freak? Where the hell did he go? Oh shit, no, go under here. Come on! He went in there! Ugh, kid! I'm going to kick your ass, you little punk. Find your little mobsman. What? Keep it. Really? Well, what do we have here? Well, you what? You want a piece property. of me? Oh, You'll be a different too. Too. Yeah. yeah, you want a piece of me? Oh yeah. Come on. Okay, these guys are a little tougher. Wow. Oh, snap. Damn. <laughs> Excellent. What else does London have to offer? Dude, what about the freaking kid? I would have kicked his ass. Now is not the time for tourism, Jacob. Now's the time to find Henry Green. I've always been the quicker climber, haven't I? Not since we were two. Race it to the highest vantage point. Oh, whatever. Seriously, uh, you were already ahead of me, bitch. Not on my <laughs> Freaking! Oh, I'll race you. Uh, well, I already have an advantage. You know what? Let's go up here. Come on, come on, buddy. Oh yeah, baby. Oh what? Hey! Whatever, she beat me. Where Damn it. Is Mr. Green's shop located? It was marked on Father's map. Uh, Two assassins, equal in height, one female, one male. Two decades old, and those devilish smiles. Hmm. <laughs> you must be the Fry Twins. And you are Henry Green, at your service. Oh. I was sorry to learn about your father's passing. Thank you. What can you tell us about Crawford Starrick? I suppose the council desires news. London must be freed to provide a better future for all of its citizens. Well, thank goodness the council saw reason and sent you to aid us. Yes. Thank goodness. <laughs> Unfortunately, I am the bearer of bad news. Today, Starrick sits at the helm of the most sophisticated Templar infrastructure known in the Western world. Every class, every borough, the gangs, the industries, his reach extends all across London. I've always thought of myself as a gang leader. Firm, but fair. Huh. Well, I have uniforms. And I'll unite a mix of disenfranchised outsiders under one name. That's it, Evie. We can rally them to our side. Oh, like the way that you rallied those car players at the Oakwood Tavern into the river. Oh, that was different. They beat me at whist. I can see it now. We'll call ourselves the Rooks. <laughs> You're never good at chess either. Have you got a better plan? Find the piece of Eden. Oh, well, let me show you the lay of the land. Shall we? Oh, come on, I liked his idea. All right, so we got to get up there. Yes, no shit. You know, that's uh, typical Assassin's Creed right there. Get to the highest point you can. And don't die getting there, because, you know, it's very, very high, typically. Nice, nice. Let's synchronize up top here. There we go. Woo! Uh, I'm a little nervous being up here. Synchronize.
Look at what Starak has done to the city. Whitechapel is riddled with crime. Child labor, despite regulations. A gang known as the Blighters overruns the streets. And Templars manipulating behind the scenes. As in all the other boroughs, we need to return this city to the people who built it in the first place. We will free London from Starrick. You have my word. And my looks. <laughs> Miss Fry, your passion is inspiring. Come. Let us return to my shop and I can bring you up to date on the rest. What rest? Oh, she likes him. She likes him. Oh, Evie's got a little crush on Mr. Green, doesn't she? 22 na new database entries. All right, Evie. Leap of faith! Woo! Hopefully, Mr. Green got out of there. Yeah, he did. Nice. Hey, Mr. Green. How you doing? We're gonna go this way. Evie, that's Evie. Well done. Hmm. London's looking pretty sweet this time of year, huh? Keep quiet. Kalok's looking for me. Who's Kalok? One of Starrick's gang leaders. Why does he want you? He's after some of my more arcane research into one of the precursor artifacts. The Peace of Eden. Hmm. So tell me about these blighters. In search of an army, Starrick gathered up the nastiest of the underworld. Some of the city's gangs tried to prevent it and were slaughtered for their efforts. Now, only Whitechapel's clinkers remain opposed, but they're no match for the blighters. Well, let's shine these clinkers up then, shall we? They're just the sort we're looking for. You can't be serious. Evie, they're ready to fight and oppose the blighters. This is my chance to step in. Look out, London. Here come the rooks. <laughs> uh, Jacob. Dumbass. The rooks! Uh, okay. I can run faster than everybody, like... Okay, what's going on? Who's this guy? Whoa! Confound this city! No one looks where they're going! Yes, I've noticed that. Bloody drood! I'll never finish it at this rate. Only Providence knows where those words are headed now. Well, I must get to work replacing them. Should you ever be in the mood for a tale or two, you can always find me where the ale is warm and tempers are hot! Hey, it's Charles! Charles Dickens! Really? That's odd man. That's cool. That Mr. Fry was Charles Dickens. Knows everyone and everything in the city. If I were you, I would keep that connection in your back pocket. Uh, Chaos gang is nearby. They must not follow me back to my shop. We'll take care of it. Yeah. You might be able to use this. What's that? Oh, God, oh guns. So. My carriage is nearby. Make use of it to throw them off my trail. I will meet you at the curio shop. Cheerio! Alright, man, so uh, we're leading these guys off. We're getting in the carriage. Where's the carriage? Oh, yeah. Drive this thing. Oh, God. We this is. Them away from green. Ha! Oh, this is not gonna go well, guys. I'm just saying. I don't know which way to go. Oh. Oh, God. Okay, that's pretty awesome. Oh, shit. Now to return to Mr. Green. What the You're relentless. That relentlessness will see me become master when we finish this. George would do nothing of the sort. Whatever's left of the creed would perish under your control. Harsh words, dear sister. Okay, I just kicked ass on the carriage, man. I do hope Mr. Green will come back safely. Don't tell me you fancy the bloke old red. And what do you suggest we do if our number one source of information turns up dead? Starrick can't be that hard to find. I say we turn the carriage round and go find him. This is why you aren't in charge. Haha, <laughs> whatever! I think I went past- I think I was supposed to turn back there. Damn. We gotta find another uh, left turn up here. Here we go. Oh, oh, it actually highlights the route. Okay. I like it! Just like uh, GTA, you know? Except I'm in a carriage, not in a freaking sports car or dominator. Move out of the way! Jeez. Been going so slow. Alright, uh I'm here. How do I get off? There. Hey! Uh Evie! Watch where you're freaking walking. Jeez. 
The curiosity shop. Evie, what the f- What is your problem? Quit getting up all in my- Why are you doing that? <laughs> Did you give them the slip? We gave them more than that. <laughs> Who are all these people? Over the years, I have established a number of connections across the city. Splendid. We'll need focused aid. Focused aid? <sighs> we take over Starek's gangs, we cripple his control. You're not aiming high enough. Starek has influence in every branch of society. We need to match him. I see what you're saying, Evie. We need the Rooks. Oh. You are not starting a gang called the Rooks. I believe I may have an idea of my own. We will need the police to turn a blind eye to activities. My ally in the force, Sergeant Aveline. I've heard he's a master of disguise. Next up, urchins. 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 Children make for excellent spies. Clara O'Day. Smart as a whip, that one. Finally, you would be wise to remember that Starek never acts alone. There are gang leaders in every borough. You'll meet them soon enough, no doubt. Rexford Gaylock. Known for his ability to vanish before your very eyes. Should we make him vanish for real? I suppose. One moment. Um, a Templar target you might want to look into. Uh, be cautious. It's rough out there. No, don't worry about me, Greeny. I can handle a few thugs. Oh, ye oh, dude. I don't know, man. He's uh, actually pretty welcome to London. Okay, get rewards. Somewhere that's green, sequence three completed. Excellent. That was all right. Um, arrive before Evie? What? Oh, that was uh, to arrive up top to meet where green green was. Damn, we failed. I know, Evie was too quick. But she had a head start. That's so unfair. Freaking, oh, let's race. But meanwhile, she's like already 50 steps ahead of me. That might be stretching a little bit. 50 yards? Uh, maybe not that much. Anyways, uh, yeah, sequence three completed. So, uh, sequence four coming up soon, guys.